Hello, my name is Rachel, and today I have some information about certain types of dinosaurs. And now we have the pterodactyl. Now there's a P at the beginning of the name, but it's silent, so pterodactyl. The name pterodactyl means winged finger. The pterodactyl belongs to the classification pterosaurus. The pterodactyl's wingspan would vary quite a bit. It could be anywhere from a few inches to 40 feet long. They were meant to fly long distances and had very keen eyesight to help them navigate. Now something that's really interesting is that paleontologists actually classify pterodactyls as flying reptiles and not as dinosaurs. According to scientists, the pterodactyl lived in the late Mesozoic period. Most specifically, that was about 65 to 251 million years ago. The pterodactyl was a carnivore, and it was a predator. It would fly around looking for prey, and then swoop down on them and get some lunch. Scientists have found pterodactyl fossils in America, Australia, Africa, and Europe. Now we're going to talk a little bit about the oviraptor. Oviraptor means egg stealer. And, okay, so I can't pronounce the name of this classification. Sorry, the information I have doesn't tell me how to do that. It tells me how to pronounce oviraptor, but not the classification. So here's the classification, right there. You see that? Read it. Pronounce it however you want, I don't care. Look it up, whatever, but there it is. The oviraptor was a pretty small creature. It was only about seven feet long and weighed between 55 and 76 pounds. Now the oviraptor had really long legs and it only walked on its hind legs. It was very fast and agile because it had to steal the eggs really quickly. Its claws were curved and sharp and um, it had a long tail, and its neck was S-shaped, and its mouth resembled kind of like a beak, like a parrot. The oviraptor lived in the Cretaceous period, most specifically about 70 to 88 million years ago. The oviraptor was an omnivore. It ate plants and animals, and scientists have found fossils in Mongolia. And in a future video, I have some frequently asked questions about dinosaurs and the answers. In a future video, facts about the female brain. Thank you so much for watching my video about dinosaurs. I'm so glad you tuned in. If you have any questions or comments, leave them for me. Please rate my video, let me know what you think about the information. And if you haven't already, subscribe. The Triterra. Triterra. The Triceratops. The Triceratops. The Triceratops. The Triceratops. <laughs> now that's all I can say is Triceratops. Okay. The reason why I think they named him him Stegosaurus. That's so sexist of me saying him. Oh. However, dinosaurs, oh my god, seriously. However, oh, I'm sorry, I almost said dinosaurs again. So, I keep wanting to say dinosaurs. However, dinosaurs, oh, oh my god, oh my god. That is just so upsetting. <laughs>